Hello, my name is Karen Neumann. I'm here with Uwe Bonhorst, COO at Intelligence, and Max White, uh, MD at Extend Technologies Australia. Thank you very much uh, for being here. Intelligence and Entity Data has announced a new strategy uh, concerning a global uh, solution company. Uh, Uwe, maybe you can explain us in few words about this new strategy. Yeah, that uh, solution company with entity data is um, the first uh, step in uh, getting the businesses uh, consolidated. Uh, it's basically uh, getting the, the business, the SAP business with an enti entity data group uh, more unified and uh, more consistent uh, by, a collaborate, by a collaboration um, of the main companies uh, which, are in the, which are providing SAP services and which are working in, the S in SAP markets. Thank you. So what, uh, what are the changes that our uh, customer uh, can expect and what are the benefits for our customer? Yeah, obviously, hopefully, there are not so many uh, changes, uh, only benefits for our customers. Uh, the main benefit that, that they will get is, or that they feel, or that they get received is uh, that we will have uh, more bandwidth, we will have uh, better reach uh, in regions where we had been as intelligence not present before, for example, Australia or Malaysia or Singapore um, and other countries are also in the pl uh, plan. So definitely more reach, more coverage uh, with, um, with our services, with our solutions and a more consistent approach within, uh, uh, within the enti entire uh, entity data group. Okay. Thank you. Could you tell us what is your role in this new uh, solution company and what is the lead that Extend will take? Sure. Thank you. Um, my new role will be the uh, CEO of the Asia Pacific Group. And in that, in that particular group, we've got three foundation companies coming into the solution company. That is Extend Technologies out of Australia, Cornerstone, which operates currently out of Singapore, Malaysia, and has a small operation in Thailand and Business Formula, um, who comes out of Malaysia. So they will be the uh, foundation members um, of the APAC group. And um, the APAC group being the, the fastest growing region in the world at the moment, will benefit from the close association that Extend Technologies has, have, have had for some time with intelligence in Germany. In particular, um, through Uber and through Herbert, uh, we've known um, each other for about eight years now, I yeah. think, Uber. Yeah. And, um, and I think that's going to be a great foundation for success throughout the region. I think the, 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 greatest, uh, the greatest benefit to our customers in the region is the consistency of the quality of delivery that we can give uh, throughout the eight or ten countries in Asia Pacific. I think that's going to be a major, major benefit to the global customers, uh, the Japanese multinationals and the local customers. Thank you. Yeah. Maybe if I can add something, I mean, that, that, um, that new group or this new for formation is not like an artificial um, formation or, or co a collaboration which, which, which is uh, defined by someone um, that is more, you know, as you mentioned, we know each other since eight years. And uh, when we first met, uh, we, we both said uh, to each other, OK, it, it would be good if we can work into a more closer together. Yes. So it's, um, it's, uh, it's a working relationship which has been established. And now we got uh, finally also some kind of an approval from, uh, from, from headquarter and also the official, uh, the official charter here as well. Thank you. Uh, so you were talking about the structure uh, of the company in the APEC region. Would you like to talk a little bit about the strategy and what is the future that you see? Okay, thank you. Yeah, thanks, Karen. Yeah, I think as Uwe said, you know, there's great synergies between intelligence and, and extend technologies. In fact, we see ourselves as intelligence's little brother. Um, we have exactly the same um, format uh, an approach to the the markets we serve. We serve by license and by service and by annuity, uh, the same way as intelligence does. And we're, the way that we are structured is by solution and by industry and technology. So that's particularly good. So look, our our approach is going to be simple. It's a crawl, walk, run approach. So the first uh, first stage or the first phase is the unification of the as is. That's the the uh, taking extend 
um, and, uh, and business formula and cornerstone and overlaying some of the great systems and processes that Itelligence uh, has and, and, and of course Extend has adopted a lot of those. So we're off to uh, a very, very good solid start and they're the basic first principles that we'll go with. The second stage is then to look at some of the newer countries and the newer geos in APAC where we're not operating collectively today. And uh, some of those countries are like Vietnam, Indonesia, the extensions in Thailand, uh, and then to move into those with proven industry expertise through the templated approach that Itelligence has. And then we'll move on to a third and then a fourth. Great, thank you. So you've started uh, talking a little bit uh, before about the cooperation between Intelligence and Extend. Uh, maybe you can tell us a little bit what the future holds uh, when it comes to this cooperation between the two companies. Yeah, I mean, uh, there's a lot of. Uh, I mean, this, this collaboration is based on the on the principle, as Max said, uh, on the principle of give and get. Uh, so we we, will, we we can give a lot to extend uh, and the region, but we will get also a lot from them. Uh, and that, that's I think is important for a, for a partnership or a collaboration that there's the same understanding um, at, and and both are contributing and benefiting from uh, from a partnership. So we have a lot of solutions that we have developed. Um, uh, that they can easily use as well in their specific markets. Uh, on the other hand, we're getting also clients from them. We're getting also some expertise and some industry ex uh, expertise that we don't we don't do not have in intelligence at the moment. So, it's it, it's widening our portfolio. It's widening our um, our expertise, our coverage. Um, and as I said, it's a, it's it's a partnership which is driven by benefits on both sides. Yeah, I think just to add to Uva's points there, um, SAP in the in the region now um, recognise us as as having one particular um, footprint uh, that will span in a consistent way um, delivery for for Intelligence's global clients and SAP's global clients right across the region, and they haven't had a partner. Uh, before they can do that. So I think to Uber's point, um, that's, uh, there are so many um, global customers that are acquiring organisations in the region, which is the fastest growing region, and obviously collectively we're going to be there to service their needs. So definitely we have a lot of things, interesting things to expect in the future uh, regarding the solution group and the cooperation between the, the two companies. Uh, so we will be happy to follow these activities with our blog. So thank you very much and uh, you, continue enjoying your day.